Greetings and welcome back to EdTech Moment. Today I want to take a quick moment to talk to you about a YouTube tip. I learned this just the other day. We're always trying to find ways to get content from YouTube into our classroom and so many districts like to filter YouTube on the web. Here's a trick that works in my district. Hopefully it works for you too. If you have the YouTube app on your iPad or other iOS or mobile device, then oftentimes that's accessing a different server uh, than the web interface is, is accessing. So districts might be able to filter the web interface but not filter the YouTube app. And I found out this is true in our district. So if you wanna show a YouTube video, for example, Khan Academy or any other kind of tutorial video that you wanna to show to give some context or some background information for your class, launch the YouTube app on your iPad. You can go ahead and search whatever content you want. And I'm gonna go ahead and open up this basic multiplication video here. And you can see that it starts playing. And I'm using AirPlay to share the screen from my iPad to my computer. So if I'm hooked up to a projector, I can show that. Or if you have an Apple TV, you can use AirPlay to show the image from your iPad to your TV as well. So several different ways to make use of the YouTube app on your iPad, iPhone, or other iOS or mobile device to get around some of the web filters that may be put in place in your district. 